After a six-year legal battle which involved emotional arguments and a DNA test, the veteran Congress politician N.D. Tiwari has finally accepted that a young man who was declared his son by the courts is in fact his biological son. Tiwari was the governor of Andhra Pradesh and a chief minister of Uttar Pradesh and Uttarakhand. He fought his son all the way to the Supreme Court for nearly six years before accepting Rohit Shekhar's relationship with him. Jaskirat Singh Bawa is with us uh, for more on the story. Jaskirat, so for, for six years, Andy Tiwari said that uh, this man is not my son, and now he admits to it. Well, does that put him in any jeopardy before the courts? Well, what's interesting over here, Pierre, is uh, we have to look at why did he do so at this stage, now that he's 89 years old at the end of his political uh, of course life. Now, the question here is that people feel that because all doors were shut, at least from the legal perspective, the High Court had very recently, just a few days back, dismissed her plea, uh, seeking exemption from, uh, uh, actually uh, seeking further relief for his side, Andy Tiwari's side. It is being felt and prevalently felt that it is only in the absence of any other further legal recourse that Andy Tiwari finally admitted defeat in this particular matter and had to actually go in to admit that uh, Rohit was in fact his biological son. Uh, this is an out-of-court settlement, so obviously the Delhi High Court will have to be informed about this. Uh, what exactly is the legal provision to allow for the out-of-court settlement, whether the plea and the petition now will be disposed of by the High Court, considering that this reconciliation has happened, or whether an undertaking will be sought from both Rohit as well as uh, Andy Tiwari, that remains to be seen at the next High Court hearing. But for now, this is a huge and very controversial legal battle that has been going on for six years, but all of the courts have been going on for more than a decade. So this has finally come to an end over here, uh, with uh, Eddie Tiwari finally admitting that he is the biological father for Rohit. Just curious, Baba, many thanks for getting us uh, those updates over there on an interesting uh, political and personal story as well.